Hey everyone, today we're taking a look at the Retrax 1 hard tonneau cover right here at E-Trailer. So this is the Retrax 1 MX. It's a hard tonneau cover, it's low profile, it has a canister style, it also has things like drain tubes, side rails, clamps. We'll talk about all of those different features and then that way you can see what is the difference between different tonneau covers and is this the right one for you? especially given that I've installed a lot of tonneau covers, is I really like how sleek this one looks. It looks great, especially here on the Nissan Frontier. It's very low profile with that canister style. It doesn't take up much room behind our window. Plus, we can see that no matter where you wanna secure it, you can secure it quickly and easily. You have those different options. The downsides though, with that latch, it's only over here. So if I wanted to go and open it up towards the cab or over here on the passenger side, that is not an option for me. I have to do everything over here. Now opening it up, I just need to push, but you would also have to reach all the way into the truck bed to bring it back out. But that's just how it goes with Tano covers. It's really up to you with what type of lifestyle are you going for? What are you carrying in your truck bed? Do you like that this has a 200 pound weight capacity and can be locked? Or is the canister taking up space inside your truck bed a deal breaker for you? So first let's talk about hard and soft tonneau covers. This is a hard tonneau cover. It has slats that slide and it can also hold up weight. In fact, it can hold up to 200 pounds of evenly distributed weight. So soft tonneau covers usually have a canvas that stretch out over the cover and some people aren't completely comfortable with that because what if it tears? What if someone tears it intentionally? With a hard tonneau cover like this, you don't have to worry about that. Now the differences between other hard tonneau covers is some are tri-folding tonneau covers where there are three rectangles that just fold onto each other. Others are like this, where they roll into a canister. This being a canister style means no matter what position you have this tonneau cover in, it's going to be low profile. So some others, they roll up and then they cover your rear window here it rolls downwards, but there is a downside to that too. A canister will take up space inside of your truck bed and the amount of space it will take up will depend on which type of tonneau cover you get for which type of truck. So for example, we have this installed on a 2022 Nissan Frontier. The size of the canister is about nine and a half inches from the top of the tonneau cover to the bottom of the canister, which leaves us nine and a half inches on the bottom of our truck bed. So for your truck, if you have a fifth wheel hitch right where I am here in the middle, you can see how you can lose some space on the front, just like as if you would have a toolbox. Plus you'd have to measure for the height of the tonneau cover. So to measure for the height, we have the side rails that sit on top of our truck bed sides, but they create rails for the tonneau cover. So your tonneau cover is actually sitting half an inch below your truck bed sides. So when you consider the half inch you lose from the side rails as well as the height of your truck bed. So for example, with this Nissan Frontier, we are left with 19 inches of actual truck bed height space. Now let's talk about using it, opening and closing the tonneau cover and how easy that is. So this slides back and forth really easy, but also you can lock it into place wherever you want. So let's say you wanna close this part of your truck bed, bringing that latch down means you cannot push this back and forth anymore. It's locked into place. So that gives you a lot more versatility compared to some other tonneau covers where they only have the all the way open or the all of the way closed position. Plus, once you have this latch down, you can then use your keys to lock the tonneau cover. So when you're ready to drive away, you close the tonneau cover, you latch it into place with the option to lock it, and then you close your tailgate. Even with the tailgate closed, you can actually open up your tonneau cover and push this open, but it will take a lot more strength. But that way, if you need to grab something real quick and you don't want to have to open up your tailgate, you can do so. The downside to that is you have to access it in the back driver's side if you want to access it over here in the passenger side 
or maybe up towards the cab, you do not have that option. All of it is operated by that latch. Now the Retrax 1MX definitely is a good looking tonneau cover. It's very sleek, it's very smooth. In fact, this has been on this truck for a couple months and it still looks almost new. It's very easy to clean off. It has a high quality polycarbonate material and that matte black finish just makes things look nice and clean. But what if a big storm kicks up or how does it hold up to the elements? Well. Even though this has been sitting out in the e-trailer parking lot for every weekday for months, it still looks really good. You can see how that UV resistance has held up and I don't see any fading from the finish. Now for those storms, if you do have that water come down, you also have these drain tubes included with your tonneau cover with them installed in the canister. This then drains that water out of your own truck's drain holes. With this being custom fit, it should work with your truck's own drain holes, but it really also depends on the truck. In fact, I had to drill this one out because we had this spray and bed liner that I had to drill through. So keep that in mind when installing this tonneau cover. But this was a look at the Retrax 1MX hard tonneau cover right here at E-Trailer. My name is Evangeline and I hope you enjoyed the journey.